This is one troy ounce of 24 karat gold, broken down into gold backs. We've got the 50s, the 25s, the 10s, 5s, 1s. If you add them all up, you get to an ounce of gold. Now this is also one troy ounce of 24 karat gold. It's an American gold buffalo. Very cool coin here. If you wanted to spend gold, to use gold as a currency, which would be easier? This gold coin or all of these gold backs? I think it's pretty easy to see the gold backs win in a barter situation. I can break them down way more times than I can this gold coin. But the question a lot of people have is, how do you know that the gold is in the gold backs? The company that makes these is called Valorum, and I thought it best that the president and founder Adam Trexler actually talk about them and give you the answer himself. And I'll just say, the testing that they do is quite amazing. My name is Adam Trexler. I'm the founder and president of Valorum. We manufacture the gold back using worm technology. So when we talk about the gold in a gold back, I'm always asked, how do I know that the gold is there? The answer starts with the underlying technology where we're building up a thin layer of gold atom by atom, and we very precisely control that. As we're doing it, as we're making multiple passes and building up those gold atoms, we are constantly checking the thickness as that process goes. Then, after we're done, we shoot an x-ray all the way through the gold, and we're able to check both purity and the thickness and verify that the batch is good. From there, we do another quality control check and we do a fire assay of bills where we actually melt the gold down, recover it, and weigh it using a very precise scale. And that becomes the basis for establishing that every production run of goldbacks has that amount of gold that we guarantee is in there. Our final check is that we regularly check our own test methods against ISO certified processes and using COMEX certified independent laboratories where they recover the gold themselves from the gold back and verify its content. And that four stage process is how we have confidence that every gold back reaches the consumer with the precise amount of gold that we guarantee is in it. If I were in a barter situation, I would much rather accept the gold backs than gold coins or gold bars because these take a lot of knowledge and equipment to be able to test and verify that they're real and authentic. And there are a lot of counterfeit gold coins and counterfeit gold bars on the market. So the question now becomes, how hard is it to counterfeit a gold back. Are there any fake gold backs floating around out there? The gold back has numerous anti-counterfeiting features built into it. Most of them, if you look at this 50, are embedded in the very way that we print. So it might look like a recurring pattern, but all of these features from the background in the sky, this strip here, the border, the fine mesh underlying this banner, are all very complicated crystallizations and tessellations that are used by governments in currency to assure the difficulty of counterfeiting. That's not all though. The reverse of the gold back, this pattern, and the built-in textures that you can see on the reverse are all an atomic deposition of gold so that the actual gold is structured with those complex patterns built into them, including the serial number. That patented government level security package is extraordinarily difficult to counterfeit. You would need programs the public doesn't have access to. Uh, you would need uh, tremendous capital to deposit gold. You would then need to have our unique formulae and then you would need to be able to put it together in a package. And we strongly believe that this is the most difficult to counterfeit product available in the precious metals market today. 
the bottom line is that you can trust the gold back. It is the real deal. And if you want to use physical gold as a currency, there's nothing like it. Now, we actually did just post a video showing how you can spend the gold backs right now. If you missed that video, definitely go check it out. There'll be a link up in the corner, as well as a link down below in the description of this video. Now, as we wrap up, I want to say one more thing about the gold backs, and that is whenever you buy something with a gold back, whenever you use one as money, you're telling the world that you don't want to use fiat currency. You don't want something that the government can manipulate, create an unlimited supply of, and devalue it until it's worthless. Gold backs are sound money they're literally backed by the gold that they contain these are what real money is supposed to be so i would encourage you to share this video with your friends and your family so we can spread the word about gold and using sound money once again also don't forget to smash that thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to our channel for more awesome videos